Supercar icons. Aston Martin 177 vs Lexus LFA. There is something special about big displacement, high cylinder count engines. Aside from their obvious power and performance capabilities, these engines often provide a very prominent vocal exhaust note. Once you hear these glorious exhausts, you are sure to be hooked. While these engines are pretty uncommon in most powertrain setups, they have featured in various supercars and some might even argue that they are a crucial aspect of classifying a car as a supercar. Aston Martin and Lexus are the cream of the crop in their respective nations. Aston Martin in Britain and Lexus in Japan. Both these countries have a proud history of performance vehicles with a heightened appeal for driving. Be it the Lotus Exige, McLaren P1, or Jaguar F-Type in Britain or the Toyota Supra, Nissan Skyline GTR, or Mitsubishi Lancer Evolution in Japan. However, the Aston Martin 177 and Lexus LFA respectively, are arguably the best-sounding and overly-engineered modern classics made in the last two decades. And they don't make supercars or hypercars like these two anymore. Let's look at how the Aston Martin 177 and the Lexus LFA compare in performance, technology, and exotic appeal. Picking the better one here is going to be a tough task. Astonishing Aston Martin 177. The 177 is Aston Martin's priced procession and one of the most sophisticated cars to come out of Great Britain. Apart from the obvious elegance, this particular Aston packs a punch. More specifically, it packs a massive 7.3-liter naturally aspirated V12 engine under the hood, producing 750 horsepower and 553 pound-feet of torque. This gargantuan engine started life as a Cosworth engine that was bored and stroked before receiving some improved internals to drop the weight of the engine itself all the while increasing the power. Power is sent to the rear wheels only through a six-speed automated manual gearbox. Every single, Neck-snapping acceleration of this British beast is sure to bring joy. The abundance of power mated to a higher vocal exhaust most reminiscent of F1 cars. But sticking to the more objective criteria of acceleration, the Aston Martin 177 accelerates from 0 to 60 miles per hour in just 3.7 seconds and will continue tearing up the asphalt until it maxes out at 220 miles per hour. The 77 designation on the car indicates that only 77 of these British beauties were ever produced, although technically a 78th exists, and were built between 2009 and 2012. Furthermore, 177 features a massive range of customizability options for customers and was hand-built. Ergasmic Lexus LFA. So what does this Japanese giant have to offer? How does it stack up against the Aston? Lexus has made a variety of popular cars over the years as the luxury branch of Toyota and remains competitive in today's market, especially regarding their unparalleled reliability. The LFA was Lexus' venture into the supercar world and while it is an amazing car it was not as well received as one would imagine. Similar to the Aston Martin 177, the Lexus LFA transcends the traditional V8 engine, which to most people is already plenty of power, in favor of a larger, higher cylinder count engine. The result? An incredible 4.8-liter naturally aspirated V10 engine that sounds insane, with some people going as far as to argue that it is the best-sounding engine ever. Besides the subjective beauty of the exhaust note, the LFA also has some seriously impressive specs going for it. The powertrain setup makes 552 horsepower and 354 pound-feet of torque, creating a 0 to 60 miles per hour acceleration time of 3.7 seconds and a top speed of 202 miles per hour. Furthermore, the car revs to 9000 RPM meaning that drivers can maximally enjoy the glory of the V10 exhaust note. Similar to the Aston, the LFA also features a six-speed automated manual gearbox and sends all the power to the rear wheels. Furthermore, the Lexus LFA was built from 2010 to 2012. Aston Martin 177 vs Lexus LFA, an apple and orange like no other. While any such comparison comes down to a variety of factors like pricing, availability, and perceived uniqueness, there is a slight difference in performance between these two vehicles. As with any supercar, factors like fuel economy are not key considerations whereas performance and exhaust note are integral to the selection process. A quick YouTube search will highlight that both of these cars have a very gorgeous exhaust note and in all honestly, that is not where the key difference lies. There are two main differences between these cars, performance and price. 
Let's get the ugly stuff out of the way. Price. Both of these cars are relatively rare in that they were only made for a limited time in limited quantities. 77 official Aston Martin 177s and around 500 Lexus LFAs, and consequently, the price tags were, and still are, pretty high for these beasts. The Aston Martin retailed for $1.87 million and the Lexus LFA for $375,000. You might be thinking that the price difference is too significant to justify buying the Aston over the Lexus. And while that is certainly a valid view, the fact that there were less than 100 177s produced means that the Aston is more likely to appreciate in the coming years. In terms of performance, the Aston Martin 177 takes the victory as well having a slightly higher top speed, 220 miles per hour compared with the LFA's 202 miles per hour despite having the same 0 to 60 mph. While the Aston Martin 177 wins by a narrow margin acquiring any one of these two cars will be no mean feat as they are incredibly rare. But if we are to speak frankly, there is no clear winner here. Both the 177 and LFA are extremely over-engineered pieces of art that will remain a testbed for current and future speed machines.